Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Teens Read. Sorry I haven't uploaded in a few weeks. Last week I was kind of busy with figuring out um, school, doing school electronically and everything, and then I forgot on Monday, and, you know, so. So today I'm going to be making it up, making up for it, um, by doing hopefully two videos. If I can't get it, them both done, then I'll do one tomorrow. Um, and this video is going to be a special type and then in this video I'm going to be comparing audiobooks, ebooks, and regular books and what are some of the disadvantages and some of the advantages of each of them and so um, also I'm going to define each of them so audiobooks are books usually um, recorded by someone um, so that you can listen to, like, so that you can listen to someone reading it to you, but you don't have to have someone there reading a book to you. Um, and they're really convenient because you can carry them around easily, and I mean, I, I could probably even record some audiobooks, but I don't know what the copyright thing is with that, probably, I don't know. Um, anyway, but, um, in my opinion, audiobooks are very nice because you can kind of multitask while doing them if it's, um, like an easy task, like building a fort or walking my dog, I often listen to an audiobook while doing, um, while doing some of those things, or cooking or cleaning or things like that, um, and I really like listening to audiobooks while doing any of those tasks that don't require a lot of brain power. Um, it's also very easily portable, um, like, I have, like, five or six on my phone, so it's just very convenient to bring around, um, and you can kind of get more if you like if you run out of audiobooks you don't have to go to the store to get more which is especially valuable in these times cuz no one wants to go to the store cuz it's like an apocalypse out there um okay so moving on to books um i really like books because they're books and they're physical things and you can kind of hold it and i really like that experience um and then I also like the flipping of pages, because it's just a very soothing thing for me. Um, and then, I also really like being able to see how far through a book I am. Um, for example, for like audiobooks, it's kind of hard to know how far through you are. There's like a 50% or whatever, and you're like 100 and out of 150 pages through. But you can't really actually like see um, on the book. Like, with this book, I can see that I'm, like, only this far through. Um, and that's, that's one of the things I really like about books. Um, and so, but books are, books have their disadvantages. Um, they're kind of, they're a little bit cumbersome, um, and they're less convenient to carry around, and, um, so those are some of the disadvantages of books. Um, and now, moving along to ebooks. Um, these are electronic books, which are basically books that have been transferred onto either the internet or a specific device. And um, Kindle, I believe, is one of the main providers of this. Um, I was going to say that. Yeah, yeah. There's Libby and Zora, which are two other things you can get ebooks on, but Kindle is the most mm -hmm. convenient thing, and it's nice because, as I said, convenient. Um, it's very thin and easy to carry around. Um, I used to bring it to school back when school was a thing, um, and it's just a lot more convenient and um, kind of easy to bring around, and yeah, helpful. So. Another thing that I like about Kindles is that you can kind of read at night time without needing a night light, and that's very convenient if you're somewhere that, like, doesn't have a light and you want to read at night. Um, it, it's so long as you have a lit screen. Um, not all Kindles have lit screens, but I find that a very helpful feature. Also, being able to just get more books whenever I'm out, it's just incredible because I have Kindle Unlimited, which is like a monthly payment, and then it gives us access to like tens of thousands of books, and I'd say we get our money's worth easily, because I just, I read tons of books um, off the Kindle. And so, 
those are, in my opinion, the main advantages and disadvantages of books, audiobooks, and ebooks. Um, and so if you liked this video and want to see more like it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Um, thank you for watching, and Jaffy, what did you do? Bye.